have a friend lived in Boston, lives in Boston, has an eight-year-old daughter, was at school. She kept getting slapped by another girl in class. She didn't bring it up. Finally, when she did, uh, they took it to the school to address it. And the school, directly out of the, the heads, the, you know, the different assistant principals of the school, said that it wasn't happening. They didn't sit well with that. Um, the school said they were investigating. They didn't sit well with that. They took it to the state. And got a pretty powerful person involved. And guess what? It did happen. And guess what else? Um, they're having to address it and dealing with it in, in a bully case. Now, it's what I've been telling you has been going on. Everything's a lie. Up is down, right? Um, that's one scenario. The other scenario is my daughter, my world. I have a daughter, it's 15, school. Um, because we've let this thing go, and I, I'm part of it, right? Uh, to the degree we have in their school, they can't use the lockers, even though their hallways are lined with them. Can't use them. No, we're not, not doing that. But what I did find out is you could ask to use them. Um, so they're all, all the lockers are empty. My daughter's in a uh, PE class, physical education. They have to put their bags in a hallway as they change their clothes, whatever, because you can't put them in a locker or locker room, so they're in a hallway. Well, during PE, somebody goes in and takes stuff from the girls, not just mine. I think a lot of the bags were rummaged through. And they, uh, uh, my daughter had a little cash on her. Whatever, I don't, you know, it is what it is. You guys have your philosophies to life and whatever. Uh, so, and, and that got taken. And um, so the first thing out of assistant principal's uh, mouth and a comment back was uh, asking my daughter why, why she carries cash. Uh, that, that didn't sit well with me. I'm, I'm not upset at the assistant principal, but it didn't sit with, well, with me on a karmic uh, perspective or from where I'm at and the seeds I'm, I've been trying to plant and, and I think how nature works and how this whole universe works. And that is this. Think about it. Uh, we've created through several years, could be even hundreds of years, a society that uh, the victims are now the criminals and the criminals are now the victims. So right out of the chute, she didn't do anything other than what she was instructed to, got money taken, and she's a criminal because she shouldn't have put money in her bags. Why'd you do that? You know, right away, pu pushing the blame on the victim. And that's what's been done to you. I've been trying to explain this to you. Uh, hopefully I can come across in a way that makes sense or an aha moment. Um, and then the criminal, they're, they're going to now look at tapes, and they may find, they may not, uh, you know, there's everything so recorded that I'm real sure they can find out who did it. I'm real sure it'll be, you know, known. She probably won't get her money back. I'm not looking at all that. And I'm not really looking to punish the person that did it. But uh, when the society uh, gets to the point that we're at, which is the, the, the victim's the criminal and the criminal is the victim, we're in big trouble. And that's happening. Uh, the pol pol politicians know this is how it's gone. And they, uh, the human nature... Uh, has been structured uh, in, in this societal uh, uh, complex um, uh, uh, form of operating that, uh, well, what more could you have done not to be a victim? You know, well, you, it, it's up to you because you should have known, but at some point we all got to stop and go, no, 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 wait a minute here. You know, uh, I don't want you to be a victim and I don't want you to be a criminal, but in, in the world, the way nature works is, you're accountable for yourself. You must, uh, from you to the universe, from you to the energies that, that you live in, you must be accountable for that. And if you infringe on somebody else and it's not correct, the universe will eventually come back and get you. We've created a scenario where that's not happening, but it's going to be fixed now. Uh, we are advanced tremendously from an energy perspective. We've been lied to on a grand scale. I've been telling you this. We've been lied to so bad that we've actually been convinced that a victim can be a criminal and a criminal can be the victim. That's how damn lied we've been to. And where we've also been lied to is uh, the fact that um, it's okay to be a victim or a criminal. I don't think it's okay to be either. I think it's okay to be accountable, right? Things happen, but what do you do with that, right? So um, you can't throw the victims always as the criminals and you can't throw the criminals always at the victim. Let's put it back in nature's hands and let's get the balance back. We will do that and we are doing that, but it had to get to this absurd place 
Not because y'all haven't. The, the ones that have been commenting and been watching my videos haven't been working on it. But because the world has uh, positioned it accordingly to where we're seeing, thinking that maybe we're wrong and we don't want to be outside of what everybody else is trying to do.